Hey, boys and girls, it's time for a brand new adventure of Drew Pendus and his mighty penultimate. Today, Drew must save. Well, just wait and see. It's a surprise. It all began as a normal day. Drew got up for school, brushed his teeth, ate his breakfast, and fed the dog. Like I said, totally normal, except... April Fools! It was April Fool's Day, and Drew was dressed as his evil twin, Ray Blank. Kids, you remember Ray? He's Drew's opposite. Ray goes around erasing everything and causing total mayhem. I'll make everyone think I'm the mean and rotten Ray Blank. Best April Fool's ever! When Drew got to school, he ran straight to the library and said, It's me, Drew Pendus' evil twin, and I'm here to erase all your books. <laughs> oh no, you won't. Go back to your evil universe where you belong. Oh no! That's the magic door that opens to cruel school. That's the opposite of cool school, where all the teachers are really mean. That door is how Drew got rid of Ray Blank last time. Drew doesn't want to go there. Wait, stop! <sighs> that was close. Miss Booksy, no! It's really me, Drew! But it was no use, kids. Sound just doesn't travel through magic doors between opposite worlds. That's just basic science. Now, Drew was trapped at Cruel School. It's just like Cool School, except it's all opposite, and terrible, and awful, and yucky, and no good. Get ready for a brand new adventure with Drew Pendus and his mighty penultimate. Today, Drew must escape Cruel School. Actually, it's simple. I'll just draw a door going back to Cool School. No, you won't. You're stuck at cruel school, like the rest of us. <laughs> My mighty penultimate, give it back. Make me. Boys, get to class now. I don't even go to the school. Quit your yapping. It's time for arts and crafts with me, Krabby Carol. Your assignment, make glitter. Lots of glitter. <laughs> Krabby Carol already had a stash of glitter so big that she could never use all of it. Finally, the bell rang. It was lunchtime. Today's lunch, toasted marshmallows. Awesome. Very toasted, like burnt and wrapped in beef liver. Ew, grody. And everybody's favorite, ice cold cheese punch. Make sure you drink every drop. This place is the worst. Oh yeah, to go with the beef liver and marshmallows, we also have bratwurst. Thanks for reminding me. Ugh. Well, the good news was after lunch comes recess. What could they possibly do at Cruel School to ruin recess? Oh no, they even ruined recess? Okay, Cruel School, you already ruined lunch, but you do not mess with recess. That's sacred. Drew couldn't take it anymore. He ran into the library and oh no, Captain Hooksy was there shredding books. Yarg, get yourself some scissors and let's cut up these books. No way! Drew couldn't do it. He knew how disappointed Miss Booksy would be if he ever damaged a library book. Then he saw Nikki. Awesome! Nikki! Boy, I'm glad to see you. What? My name is Tricky. I tell kids facts that aren't true and trick them. Oh no! I have to get out of here! Hey, you look like my friend Ray. Drew ran out into the hallway right smack into a big metal wall. Wait, that's not a wall. Looking for this? Well, it's mine now. So get lost! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I wish Nikki really was here so she could help me come up with a smart plan. Wait, I know! I'll ask Tricky and then do the opposite, whatever she says. Oh, hey Tricky, I want to ask you something. If you had to defeat an evil giant robot, what would you do? Obviously, I would invite him to a tea party and then we'd play dress up and have a karaoke party. What? That's a crazy answer! But it does give me an idea. Huh? <laughs> Dear Ray, you are invited to a really awesome party. Now, at the library, bring your new cool pen, your friend Tricky. Awesome! I love parties! Drew hid out near the library, waiting for his evil twin. I thought I told you to get lost! Thanks for the marbles, Ray. Wanna play? Whoa! And thank you for my penultimate. Ooh, and this handy eraser. Drew made a door back to Cool School and jumped through. Hmm. Happy April Fool's Day, Cool School. See ya, hopefully never. This time, Drew erased the door just to be safe. Drew, where have you been? April Fool's? 
Well, kids, it was a happy ending after all. Drew made it back to cool school just in time for lunch. And it was pizza day with tater tots and a brownie for dessert and a fruit punch. And now Drew had Ray Blight's evil eraser. So that should be the end of Ray. Or is it? Moral of the story, boys and girls, watch out when you're playing a prank. You just might end up at cruel school. And whenever you're in a jam, always use your marbles to figure a way out. Hey, I gotta give a shout out to Michelle for the idea of a robot that shoots marbles. That was awesome. Maybe next time I'll use that myself. Don't forget to comment on what Drew should draw on his next adventure. And don't forget to subscribe.